essentially saying is that there are certain situations that you can stand on that side of them where the person can decide that it's in the best information or something and do something with it. But when the person does it, that means that it is not it. By definition. It was a hard fought series and a, a, a wild night sort of a very dangerous situation in that city in our dock. Elliot. Elliot has been tracking all of this overnight nasty. Yeah, we can see it. I mean, it was a terrifying scene there in Vancouver. Angry fans obviously pouring out into the streets. Emotion. Heightened. There's four stabbings in its resort were, were reported. The scene's so chaotic and violent, ambulances actually couldn't get through to help those in. Vancouver transformed into a war zone. Fires erupted in busy downtown intersections. Flames shot 30 feet into the air. Storefronts smashed by looters grabbing everything in sight as people dangled from light poles. While police in full force struggled to contain the crowd with tear gas, two of their cruisers set ablaze. The city's mayor described the participants as hooligans. The reason for all of this chaos? A hockey game. Welcome back to USA Bird. Let's take a look at Tatiana Conrad's first book event. Let's take a look at this. And I was in my mind. And I think because of my knowledge, my experience, everything accumulated inside me, it wanted to go up. So maybe it was point in my life because I turned 60. And uh, I read a lot of people who turned 60 because they began to uh, do a lot of painting, write books, and do something. So maybe it was going to turn my life. It reminded me of the Don Juan mm -hmm. series, Carlos Castaneda, in which uh, he altered his view of the world and the way of the to use a second job. So something similar happened to me. I think it, it, it turned me into and uh, it was like the unconscious, I didn't think about it. When I started writing my book, my friends said to me, I didn't think. Just everything from unconscious to all. So in this book, love, my thoughts, feelings, emotions, it was lot of conversation for a Not about young people, you know. And uh, I have one character which is the last of the And uh, students, questions, girls, as nature, like people. I, I remind, uh, like, when I was young, I spent uh, life in life, you know, and uh, I had a lot of questions, and uh, I tried to find answers, and when I found answers, I was so happy with myself. Because I need to have my business surround me. And uh, I'm not a, a comp. I, I feel like I accomplished now something very really important in my life. Yeah. And uh, this book, it's uh, a lot 
a female character, and every female character has a little, little bit of hope. It's me everywhere. Like, you know, it has inside, and I tell you, like a lot of diff different, different, different personalities, and everyone tends to be different. So, today you feel like this, you, feel, you can feel different ways. So, I have uh, a lot of uh, female characters. Mm -hmm. And all my different way of thinking of the stories. So, you know, it's like, it is unusual. Thanks again, thank you, my name is Nadia. It is not boring. And uh, all, all keep you, uh, keep your interest even more and more in the fine songs. And if you read my book, then. No, 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 no. So, you know, I will tell you that I enjoy reading all my books. Every day I go back, I open, and listen, read, because I, now I write in sequels, where the characters, their relationships more involved in conflict. So I like live now life as a spirit. You know, you, you know the parents, right? You know, it's like your baby, right? Yeah. You, you want something. You feel like you want something. And you, did not take, you won't take care of it. What you create, what you want, what you create. So it's my ideas, and I love this book. I I so happy, and I choose this cover. Thank you for asking me. Thank you for having interest in my book. I'm very excited that you have interest in it. Thank you. Oh, my God. Yeah, very good. Mm. Can I give you the sign? Yeah. Name is Tell me, spell me. I will train you. I I This is your very first uh, book event. And I want, I want to know, uh, uh, how do you feel your experience in the very first one? And then, uh, just when I entered in uh, Monroe City, it was a new city, and I have been in the city. It was so exciting for me. I love the city, very old buildings, and uh, people look around, and a uh, lot. Stories. When I saw this bookmark store, it sounds so good. It's when I came in bookmark store. It's very old, built, old store, mm -hmm. and uh, it's like like this store. I feel energy from uh, books and people who came here visited by book. Now now there's uh, a lot of people about Kindle, but it is big difference. When you can come in bookstore and see real books and uh, you feel energy from this book. I said it's very exciting. So I like atmosphere in this book store. And I had some customers who ask me questions and I enjoy answering questions. Because it's my book. I create it like I wrote this book from all my heart and soul. And uh, I enjoy talking to customers. Tell a little bit about my book. But my book, unusual, uh, there's an unusual love story between two actors who fell in love with each other. And uh, my inspiration was that book. It's just I had a daydream and I saw paintings, her beautiful music, and uh, the entire story just ran in front of my eyes. And I think it's a mystery in itself. It could happen with me. And I feel so happy because I talk about my book, my book. I sell my book. And do not point about make money from sale. I just I want that 
will share my knowledge, experiences, people, like my gift message to the world. And uh, I so enjoy doing so. I so enjoy sitting. And I believe that I will have a lot of book events too through ASA Publishing Company. Because I'm happy with ASA Publishing Company. I believe in success together, like team, ASA Publishing Company, or the it is team. I believe in success. It was a uh, um, first time experience. Uh, um, this year is your first time author, uh, first book event. I mean, your experience. How, how do you uh, um, feel? How, how do you, you feel? I mean, it's your first. What, what, what would you like to tell tell the uh, uh, all the uh, authors that you know who never got a chance to have a book event and they want to have a book event? Uh, um, Tell me your experience. How do you feel about because you're your first time, you know, you're excited, yes. nerve has a nervous wrecking, you know. Yeah. You mean? Yes, I'm a little bit nervous because it's new. Everything new, you're a little bit nervous because it's new, you don't have experience. When you have, have experience, you do better and better, you're more uh, comfortable. And, uh, you know, I feel like I have accomplished something very important in my life. And uh, I'm here in present time, and uh, I spread my feelings, emotions, and energy in this atmosphere, in this story. And I believe that customers will come here, they will feel my emotion. It will stay here. And uh, if it is go from your heart and soul, it's right way. You can feel it is right way. I, I feel so happy now, excited, happy, and I feel it is right way for me. I want promotion of my book. I want marketing. I want to send more and more messages to the world. I want to give. I want to do some for people. I myself enjoy reading my book. I want to be So my goal is deliver my thoughts, feelings, emotions, ideas to the public. And uh, I believe that my book can help people to create new ideas, to accomplish something for them, and to maybe find the right way. I want that the uh, world was in harmony and balance. If everybody were in harmony and balance, well, it will be in harmony and balance. It will be peace. Everybody wants peace. And I believe in peace. I believe in a wonderful life. And I, I want to share with everybody my thoughts, feelings, and emotions. I want to give some people.